Seven years ago, I was handed a big yellow envelope by my fifth grade teacher with a student U application inside of it. I looked over it on the bus, and as soon as I got home, I started filling out the part that said, do anything you'd like in the space provided. I had just learned about line segments, so I decided to draw a castle out of line segments. Now, it's difficult to think about what my life would be like without suiting you. Seven years ago, I had no idea that I was about to step into a community that would introduce me to some of my best friends, that would teach me so much, not only about myself, but about growing up, and that would give me the opportunities that I didn't have being an underrepresented minority. My name is Jaziri Perez Garcia. I was born in Mexico and immigrated here when I was two years old. I lived most of my life undocumented and inevitably faced many barriers. It wasn't until I turned 15 that I was able to apply to the Deferred Action for Childhood Arrival Policy, or DACA. It was one of the best moments of my life. For the first time in 15 years, I had a social security number, I had a work permit, and I was able to get an ID. Although an ID is something many people overlooked, to me, it meant something big. It meant that I finally had an identity. <laughs> Even though being a Dacamente Latina comes along with many barriers, I didn't truly experience them until I began the college application process. I had to take many things into consideration. In the state of North Carolina, undocumented and documented students have to pay out-of-state tuition, which is incomparably larger than state tuition. Similarly, being a first-generation college student, I didn't know about the kinds of tests I had to take, the classes I needed, and what extracurricular stood out the most. My parents were learning about this right beside me. This is one of the hardest and most draining things I've had to do so far, and if it wasn't for student you, I genuinely don't think I would have succeeded. It all began in sixth grade when we visited our first college. I vividly remember waiting in my family room 6C, matching with all of our friends and studying new t-shirts and feeling anxious and excited to see a real college. Although at that time, college seemed so far away, that was the beginning of an abundance of college tours we would take. At first it was cool just seeing the pretty campuses, but after some time, we began to learn what kinds of questions to ask and what to look for. We began, some students like small liberal art colleges with small class sizes, but others preferred big research universities. We began learning about the majors and minors we could study and about the different clubs and organizations at each school. Likewise, the ACT and SAT exams are one of the most important components of the college application. And because of Student U, I was able to take three preparation courses and we take the ACT exam two extra times. They also introduced me to many competitive scholarships and programs. I was able to become a Quest Bridge College Match finalist and apply to 21 colleges for free. And they gave me the opportunity to get an internship at Duke, where I saw the development of a treatment for cervical cancer that would be sent to developing countries. Student U is the reason why I'm going to UNC Chapel Hill with a full ride. <laughs> of a deal this is. I'm a first generation high school graduate and college student. I come from a low income and undocumented family. The way that the American government is set up, the only kids who should experience this type of success are white Americans. Student U is changing that. My story is not the only success story in the room. My peers have achieved many amazing things and are on their way to become extraordinary leaders. Although Student U has helped us in our academics, it has also allowed us to figure out the best versions of ourselves. It's scary to think about what my life would be like in the preceding years and how I'd be able to handle living alone for the first time. It's also sad to think about the many different places the Student U class of 2019 is going. We are going to be away from each other for the first time in six years, seven years. I want to thank you guys. 
for creating amazing memories with me, teaching me so many things, and allowing me to be myself. I have no doubt, doubt that your futures will be exactly what you dreamed they'd be, and that all your hard work will pay off. Please keep this bittersweet moment in mind the next time you get frustrated and overwhelmed, overwhelmed with the immense amount of homework we're going to have and the challenges that come ahead. Remember that the student you family recognizes your struggle and believes that you're capable of overcoming it and more. Please keep this family that we have created in mind when you continue discovering the best versions of yourself, creating new families and growing old. I love you guys. I love you.